Justin here doing a very quick review here on the uh, HK Flak and with the G10 right here uh, titanium coated blade pretty heavy dude let's let's check the weight on this thing it might be too heavy for my scale yeah too heavy for my scale but you can check it out on the website the reason I got this it is a heavy beast but the reason I got this is because uh, HK knives ended their their uh, production with Benchmade this so this is a foreign made uh, knife but with the tolerances and quality of the Benchmade uh, usual products very nice very cool looking in hand very sharp as always combo edge there uh, nice generous thumb hole give you a, a close up here if I can get a little sharper of an image there maybe maybe not got this iPhone 7 very cool thick blade Super stiff when you come when when you first fold it, but it's assisted open. Boom, love it. Tip down or tip up carry only. No option on that. Got that clip or sorry, tip down only. Nice uh, D carry clip though. Really like it. Value, fifty bucks for a bench made. Yeah, I'll do it. I'll do it all day. Cool factor definitely has it. Blade shape is super cool. Let's get you some data on this. We'll go ahead and measure blade thickness at the spine there, 0.111 of an inch. And let's see, we'll get you one right here. It's going to be 0.52 of an inch, a little more than half an inch. Very cool. Cool blade. Don't regret it. Um, get these while you can, dude, because they're not going to be around uh, for much longer. The supply is drying up. So this is this is a late 2017 get these while you can very cool coloration titanium coated as i mentioned earlier uh no hot spots either good ergos i have large hands it fits just right yeah dude totally worth it 50 bucks i'll do it all day Alrighty, 87 out